cross country, the sport of running far distances on all natural terrain. And with players like Josh Campbell, Cat Kirby, and coaches like Adam Schwartz and Haley Anderson, goals are never unachievable. Looking at last year, I think we're a little bit better than we were last year. Um, you know, we lost a, a really phenomenal senior last year in Blaine Connors, and then um, JC, JT Sargent was also a phenomenal addition. But um, this year, the way the guys have stepped up and to fill those roles, we've had some uh, great freshmen come in. Really shooting for about regionals and semi-state, but this year we're shooting for state. Uh, we're uh, really putting together a pretty good squad and really looking to peak uh, our talent right there at the end of the year, end of October. I wasn't here for the last couple of years, so I just, this is my first year assistant coaching. Um, but in comparison to previous years, um, like, like Kat had said, we're definitely a more cohesive group. We have a great group of freshmen that have come in and they're really um, creating a great atmosphere for the team. It's, I enjoy the, the, you know, the athletic part of it, but I also enjoy really just the, the atmosphere that we have here at the cross country program. Um, they show up every day, they want to work hard, and they're willing to uh, put in all that requires to be at their best. So. My favorite part is how we're all like a big old family. We're all super close and like we are never not around each other. Uh, definitely uh, being with the guys and uh, forming uh, great friendships. Uh, it's just uh, great to be out there and hard uh, put in hard work with them. We're all just shooting for that same goal, getting to state. I love working with the girls. Um, they're a great group that um, they love to run and they love to spend time with each other and it's something I did when I was a student. So it's great to see um, the girls enjoy something that I enjoyed too when I was their age. With their enthusiasm and camaraderie, we'll just have to see where it all takes them. Reporting for Grizzbiz, this has been Thomas Bolton.